let's see. Good morning, dear friends. Um, we are going for a ride. Good morning, dear friends. It is 624 on Monday morning, the, what is today? The 24th of uh, mm, 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 August. Last night, I was able to uh, go to the location where the police had uh, pulled my car over from the perpetrators of the theft and had arrested um, the people who had taken my car and had found the uh, drugs and paraphernalia that they had here in the vehicle. And this morning, I am going down the street because I'm going to go find a car wash and I'm going to clean out the crud and give my baby a bath. I'll do the fine detail work later, but um, I'm just so glad to have wheels back. I was so afraid that something was going to happen. I wouldn't have a car to transport Ron. You know, we just got our electric back yesterday and the temperatures here are going to soar into the 90s now. So, um, we are so lucky. We are so lucky. We are so blessed. We have electricity. I can lock the garage door down. Um, the guys were here this weekend and they tore down the damaged stuff off of our patio area. And, um, The other people are supposed to come today. And I've got a, a dumpster full. They're supposed to come and pick up that first dumpster full. Um, I've got all the rubble from the tear down this weekend. I'm going to have to eventually get another dumpster. But um, tomorrow, the guys are coming to take down the two. Well, they're going to take one big ash tree down in back. And they're also going to um, trim up my sunburst locust as best they can. I'd, I'd really like to preserve that tree because it's the only shade I've got left in the backyard. So we're going to try and save what we can of that. And then once the uh, ash tree is down, we can take down the garden shed because the ash tree is sitting on top of the garden shed. So then all of that can go into a big dumpster and they can haul all of that off. And then I can start the rebuild but then I'll have to see about getting permits and what I have to have to rebuild. So um, that's the plan anyway. Uh, still people without electricity, lots of homeless. Uh, it's, it's still devastation here. This is um, the start of week three. And I think I saw last night that there were about 7,000 homes that still didn't have power. I've been trying to reach out to my friends now that we have power and see if there's anybody that I know that doesn't so that they can come to a cool place now that I have air. You know, they can come and hang out in my craft room or something and, you know, get cool. Come, come play with my stuff and just relax, you know. I've got a kitchen. I've got, you know, I've got everything. I'm set. But I just wanted to give you the update. Uh, I, I haven't showered or anything this morning. I'm just, I'm on the road because I, I need to go take care of this stuff so that I just feel cleaner and better about what happened to us, you know, because you just feel violated. When they, they came, they, they had to have been watching. The garage door was down. So they had to know that it wasn't locked in place because of the uh, electrical outage in my shoulder because I can't, I can't do it. I, can't, I don't have the strength. And they opened the garage, got my car, and got it out of there. I mean, who does that? How do, you, how do they even know to do that? You know, anyway. Well, I quit harping on this, and I'm just about at the car wash, so um, hopefully my baby's going to enjoy the bath, and I will get on with my day. Thanks for watching, guys. Love you guys all so much. Um, you've been great support for me. I, I just can't 
tell you how much it means to have all of you with well wishes and you know I'll, I'll be back and we'll get internet eventually and I'll be back to making videos and stuff I for now I all I can do is shoot with my phone so thank you thank you love you all